All week long, comicbook.com are covering the best comic book movies you can watch on each of the major platforms, because that's sort of our bread and butter. Luckily, even in the crazy times we're living in, we've got access to all the comic book movies we need to keep us busy, especially if you're signed up for Disney+. Plus. Let's be honest, if you're a Marvel fan, Disney Plus is the streaming service for you. What's up guys, Chris Killian here, and these are the 10 best comic book movies to binge. Might as well kick off with the movie that started it all, Iron Man. If you're diving into the MCU in the order they were released, Iron Man is where you need to start. In the number 9 spot is Doctor Strange. It's surprising it took as long as it did for Doctor Strange to get his own movie, but it was worth the wait with Benedict Cumberbatch and director Scott Derrickson delivering what's probably the trippiest movie in the MCU. At number 8 is Captain America Winter Soldier. If the first Cap film was a period piece, then this was more of an espionage conspiracy thriller. It's really a testament to how good the Captain America movies are that they almost switched genres from film to film. Almost out of nowhere, the Russo brothers came along and turned out a movie that was thrilling, action-packed, and politically relevant. Number 7, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. I love this movie almost as much as the first one. The cosmic visuals are spectacular, the chemistry and camaraderie of the team are turned up to 11, and the scenes between Drax and Manus are hilarious. Heck, even 80s action stars like Sylvester Stallone and Kurt Russell get roped into the mix. At number 6, I've got Thor Ragnarok. Who'd have thought that the God of Thunder would end up being the funniest character in the Marvel Cinematic Universe? But that's what happens when you let Taika Waititi mold Chris Hemsworth into a muscled up riot machine. In the fifth spot goes to Black Panther. Arguably one of the best standalone MCU movies delivered thus far, Black Panther was a perfect follow up to the character we started to get to know when he made his soft debut in Civil War, which we'll discuss here in a bit. Number 4, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1. Seriously, what's not to love about this movie? Chris Pratt is the GOAT as Star-Lord, fans got their first really good look at Thanos, and James Gunn even squeezed out the strongest acting performance of Vin Diesel's career using only three words. I am Groot. That last part's mostly a joke. Number 3 is Captain America Civil War, which might more aptly be called Avengers 2.5 since it rounds up just about everyone excluding Thor and Hulk, even introducing Spider-Man and Black Panther into the MCU. Civil War is a personal favorite. Coming in at number 2 is The Avengers. It brought Iron Man, Thor, Cap, Hulk, Black Widow, and Hawkeye all together and it forever changed the way superheroes on screen could work. Now we organize just about every franchise into a cinematic universe and it's pretty much because of The Avengers. Number one is the big one as they say, Avengers Endgame. The definitive conclusion to the Infinity Saga that had begun 10 years earlier, considering it's now the number one movie of all time, you've probably already seen it, but it's only on Disney Plus if you want to watch it again. And that's the list for Disney Plus. Tweet me at Chris Killian or tell me in the comments what your favorite comic book movie on Disney Plus is. If you need help finding something good to watch on the other streaming platforms, well, be on the lookout for our other videos because we've got you covered there too.